text screenshot white and pink chessboard. Use one by one format. Click canvas and select dark red color. Click chroma key. Pick color pink and adjust the intensity and shadow. When done, export it. Go back to the project and add the exported clip. Delete the first project, adjust the clip like this, then add animation combo angle 2. Click canvas, select color green. When finished, export it. Download Blackpink MV, copy the link. Go to Google and search YouTube video downloader. I use this save from net, paste the link and select 720p. Upload the Blackpink MV and freeze this part and delete excess part. Add the green screen chessboard, freeze the first part and delete excess part. Use chroma key, pick color green and adjust the intensity to 7 and shadow to 15. Align the green screen to the chessboard like this. Use mask split to crop the green screen, move the double arrow a little to create soft shadow to this part. Overlay chess flying green screen, just search here in YouTube, you can download or screen record it. Use mask rectangle to get the chess piece you need. Use chroma key, pick color green and adjust the intensity and shadow to 100. Align the chess piece to this part and add keyframe. Just use the mask rectangle to crop the piece and to hide the other pieces and keyframe to look like the piece is floating. Do these steps to each chess piece. When done, you can trim the clips for as short as 1.2 second or 1.0 second. You may also change the color of the chess board according to your preference. Now zoom out the main clip to get the pink background. CapCut is limited to 4 or 6 overlay, so we need to export this clip. Go back to the project and add the exported clip. Add Ginny removed background photo as overlay, then place it similar to the original photo. When done comparing, delete the first project. Just align the overlay to main clip, then export it. Go back to the project and add the exported clip and delete the last project. Trim the clip to hide the unwanted part like this. Change the speed to 0.2 times and tap make it smooth and better quality. Then add effects, party unreal to retro nostalgic light, adjust nostalgic light to filter 0, intensity 35, range 65. And frame electric light border, then adjust horizontal shift 10, speed 100. Color 100, size 100, intensity 5, range 50. Then zoom out the clip like this, then export it. Go back to the project and add the exported clip. Remove the project and add black photo from stock video for 3.2 seconds. Add a freezed clip of this part of the video for 3.2 seconds in between with the black photo and the edited clip. Add a small part of effect basic shake at the first part of the freezed clip. Then add electric light border, adjust, color 100, horizontal shift 5, speed 5, size 100, intensity 5, Rotate 50.
Just copy the shake effect and add it in between freezed clip and edited clip. Now add keyframe at the first part and middle part of the freezed clip, then zoom the first keyframe like this. Then add another effects and a second shake effect, slanted blur and two small part of nostalgic light. Keyframes for the edited clip, first keyframe use mask film strip and adjust in full screen. Second keyframe adjust the film strip, where small amount of black part is shown. Third keyframe same steps, but more black part is shown. Fourth keyframe, same steps but now adjust the film strip in full screen and zoom the clip a bit like this at the fifth keyframe. Sixth keyframe, no film strip, just zoom out the clip again like this. It should look like this. When finished export the clip, then make a new project and add the exported clip, add the music, and add the black pink MV. Get this part, trim it, and remove excess parts. Trim the edited first clip to 9.9 .9 seconds. This second clip is 1.8 second, trim to 0.7 second. Then close the project and duplicate. The copied project will serve as the editing project, and the other one will be the edited project. Go to the copied project and remove all except the last clip. Be careful not to close the project so that you can undo or bring back the other clips. Now freeze the last part of the clip. Add the black pink MV clip again and get this part. This first clip is 0.7 second. Change the speed to 0.5 times and click make it smoother better quality. Then move to last clip and freeze the first part and make the freezed clip as overlay to second clip. Tap the freezed clip and use mask circle, pinch it to make it smaller. Add effect shadow angel to circle overlay. Tap the overlay and use mask again and adjust a little the double arrow, then align the circle to eye area. Remove the last clip for a while, then export the remaining clips. Go back to the project and click undo to bring back the last clip that was removed earlier. Now add the exported clip and delete the other project. Trim the first clip to 2.3 seconds. Add keyframe. Here I already added the keyframe. First keyframe zoom out this way, second keyframe still zoom out but a little smaller, third keyframe original size of the video, fourth keyframe zoom out like this, where the eye is in full screen. I also added graph is in one, at the last part only. Second clip duration is 1.6 second, split at this part, or middle part, then delete the first part. Now the clip is 0.8 second. Freeze this first part and overlay the freezed clip. Just align it to the eye part or last keyframe. Tap the overlay and use mask circle. Just align the circle image with the eye area and drag the double arrow a little. Add keyframe then move to this part and use the mask circle again, then adjust or make it a bit bigger like this. Make it look like this. Then move a bit to show the next clip 
and split the overlay at this part. For the second clip keyframe, first keyframe normal size, second keyframe zoom out a little, third keyframe zoom out again, then freeze the last part of the clip and trim it to 0.1 second only. Add keyframe at the first part and at the last part zoom out more. It should look like this. When finished export it, then go back to the project and undo all. Close this project and go to the main or edited project. Add the clip that was just exported. Add effect. Retro nostalgic light in between with the first and second clip. Adjust the effect. Intensity 100. Filter 0. Range 80. When finished, close the project and go back to the copied project. Add the Blackpink MV and get this part of Lisa. Remove everything except Lisa. This clip is 0.3 second. Change the speed to 0.2 times and click make it smoother better quality. When done, add animation combo wave and slide, then export it. Go back to the project and add the exported clip. Trim the last part of the clip to 1.2 second Delete the other project, add animation combo slide and wave, then export again. Go back to the project and add the exported clip, delete the other clip. This clip is 1.2 second, trim it to 0.9 second. Change the speed to 0.3 times and make it smoother better quality. When done, add the Blackpink MV again and get this part. Now we have two clips. Add Effect Basic Cinema to first clip. The second clip duration is 0.9 second. Change the speed to 0.4 times. Then add Transition Mix for 0.4 second. When done, export the clip. Go back to the project, undo all and then close the project. Go to the edited project and add the exported clip. Then add this part, add white photo from stock video as overlay for about 0.3 second, then splice overlay and add animation out fade out. Next at this part of the clip, add money green screen as overlay, just trim it, pick one, use mask rectangle, and use chroma key to remove the green. Zoom out the money overlay. Drag the money upward like this, then add keyframe at the first part of the overlay. Move a little, drag the money downward, then keyframe is automatically added. Trim excess part, add another clip from Blackpink MV. Then trim the last part clip of Lisa, Ensure the overlay is in between with Lisa and Jiso clip. Lisa clip is now 3.3 seconds and Jisu clip is 0.6 second. Trim it to 0.3 second. Then freeze the last part and trim it to 0.4 second. Change the speed of the overlay to 0.6 times for the keyframe. Just follow what I did. It should look like this. Then add 
Then add the Blackpink MV again and get this clip of Jisoo. Duration 0.1 second. Freeze the first part of Jisoo clip and trim to 1.1 second. Starting from this freezed part clip of Hiso add effects. Detail Summer Bubbles 1. D3D Lightning. Retro Nostalgic Light. Basic Shake and Basic Slanted Blur. This last two effects are placed into the first and last part of the clip. Next add this clip of Jisoo and Rose saying. Duration 0.4 second. Now just copy the shake and slanted blur effect and place it at the last part of the clip. And for the last clip, duration 2.8 seconds, I added keyframe to create movements like this. Just adjust the opacity of the last keyframe to zero. Result.